Hi, and welcome to Assignment 002 in Introduction to Programming. We are going to work with foreground colors today. And again, we are going to start by creating our internal documentation, beginning with our name, beginning with the course, uh, 101, today's date, which is May. Whoops. Now, see what happened because I didn't use the apostrophe. The date is coming up in a completely different color and it wants to treat um, the text that I'm entering as a command. So I put in my apostrophe, May 23rd, 2019. Um, again, the title of the program is 002A and we are calling it foreground colors. And what is this supposed to do? This program is meant to demonstrate the different text colors that can be used in small basic. Okay. So again, first thing that we're going to do is we are going to use our text window to open the DOS shell. And we are going to set, you'll notice that background color came up. We are going to go foreground and you can click here, double click. And we are going to go equals because we are going to provide a, um, a value for excuse me, we're going to provide a value for the foreground color. Um, for example, I am going to select 14. Now I am going to go text window dot right line and open my brackets. This time I'm using quotes. See, this is yellow. Period, close quotes, quote brackets. Now, to be a good programmer, I should continue my internal documentation. So I've added a line between text window foreground color and text window right line. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a comment in this line here on line eight and setting the foreground color to yellow. And now I'm going to add another comment um, setting the screen output. Okay. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because if anybody's looking at it, especially if it's a long program, they can see what each part of the program is supposed to do. And if I have done this correctly, we are going to run it, and there you go. See, this is yellow, and because I used right line, it is now moved down a new line. Enjoy. 